Hi, welcome to Adfield. Today we are looking at the Adfield PEC 200 machine. It is Adfield's intermediary pet crematorium machine designed to process approximately eight animals per working day. As you can see, this machine is actually installed in a container. Uh, it's done this because it reduces site construction time and also provides the customer with a ready-to-go installation from day one. I'm going to run through some uh, of the features of this machine. And at first we're going to actually start with the primary chamber. So, open up the primary chamber, you can see that we have a large enough volume there for uh, anywhere from a small cat up to a Great Dane. The primary chamber is loaded um, usually with a, uh, a roller trolley and then it is de ash by putting the ashes uh, from the hearth directly into the ash box below. Uh, the ash box can then actually be removed and taken to the cremulator, which is the ash processing machine at the back of the machine here. Um, the ash processing machine essentially refines the remains into a powdered format that the, actual, the, the customer expects. But um, this machine has a few extra features um, because it's installed in a container. So we have uh, an extraction system here that takes any uh, gases from the primary chamber when it's opened up and out of the machine. We also have twin strip light, uh, lighting. We have a distribution board with the extraction fan switches and the light switches. We also have a 240 volt outlet for the remains processor machine. On the side here we have the control panel and we have the uh, adjustable air. The air adjusts the uh, combustion um, by introducing more combustion air when you have a high calorie value animal to compensate for the additional energy in the machine. The control panel is the hub of the machine. It will show the operator um, the times that we are uh, into the burn process. It will also show you the primary chamber te uh, temperature, uh, the secondary chamber temperature and the hearth temperature. The hearth is a chamber below the primary chamber. It's designed to essentially heat uh, the refractory floor from underneath. This prevents any cold spots uh, underneath an animal where it be situated. So it also provides uh, combustion from um, two sides at once, essentially. At the, at the back, we have uh, the cremulator. The cremulator is designed to Take the remains into the top here. I'll just open up. The remains are processed in this chamber. The lid goes back on. Once it's processed, the remains are then tipped into a bin or an urn below where they can be collected. This process takes about 30 seconds. Okay, so that's been the PET 200 machine. You can find out more at adfield.com. Thank you.